In this video, we will first define probability. Then we will cover the rule of complements, the addition rule, probabilistic independence, conditional probability, and the Bayes theorem. A probability is a number between 0 and 1 that measures the likelihood that some event will occur for a random variable. An event with probability 0 cannot occur, whereas an event with probability 1 is certain to occur. An event with probability greater than 0 and less than 1 involves uncertainty. Here are some examples. The odds of winning a lottery, the likelihood of a particular candidate winning an election, or the chance of rolling a 4 on a fair die. In the case of the die, there are six sides, so the odds of rolling a 4 are 1 out of 6. The complementary rule in probability is simply the probability of an event not occurring. If A is any event, the probability of A is P of A. The complement of A is the event that A does not occur. The probability of the complement of A is shown by this equation, 1 minus the probability of the event occurring. In our dice example, the probability of getting a 4 was 1 in 6. So the probability of not getting a 4 is 1 minus 1 and 6, which equals 5 and 6. The addition rule of probability involves the probability that at least one of the events will occur. Events are exhaustive if they exhaust all possibilities. One of the events must occur. For example, when we roll a six-sided die, we will always end up with a number between 1 and 6. We say that events are mutually exclusive if at most one of them can occur. For example, you can't roll a 3 and a 6 on one die at the same time. If you have two mutually exclusive events like our 3 and 6, then the probability of either one occurring is the sum of the two separate probabilities. If two events are independent or their outcomes aren't affected by each other, then the probability of both A and B occurring is simply the product of the two probabilities. In the case of our die, the probability of getting a 6 on the first roll and getting a 3 on the second roll is 1 in 6 times 1 in 6, which equals a 1 in 36 chance. Sometimes the probability of one event will affect another. These are called dependent events, and their probabilities are called conditional. This is the formula for conditional probability. The conditional probability of A conditional that B has already occurred, is equal to the joint probability of both of the events occurring together, divided by the probability of B occurring, without regard to whether A has occurred or not. The Bayes theorem allows us to estimate posterior probabilities once we obtain new data. With it, we can measure the likelihood of event H occurring once we obtain particular pieces of evidence from data D. The parts of the theorem include the independent probability of H, or prior probability, the independent probability of D, the conditional probability of D given H, or likelihood, and conditional probability of H given D, or posterior probability. This concludes our video on basic probability. Today we defined probability and covered the rule of complements, the addition rule, probabilistic independence, conditional probability, and the Bayes theorem. <laughs>